Well, for some people looking to buy a Christmas tree this season, they may want to do it sooner rather than later. The Christmas tree shortage across the nation is causing concerns. But Sarah Winkleman spoke with local tree suppliers to see the impact here in Minnesota. Nearly 10 years after the recession in America, it's still causing issues for the Christmas tree industry. Don't just produce a seven foot Christmas tree overnight. It takes years. So there's a lot of planning involved in the whole nursery business. After the recession in 2008, a decrease in demand meant tree farmers planted fewer trees that year. Experts say most Christmas trees take between 8 to 12 years to grow, and that's why this year is hitting the industry hard, but not necessarily in Minnesota. They're grown right here, right in Minnesota. Part of the reason that the tree shortage hasn't hit hard in Minnesota is due to local tree production and many customers buying local. We've seen no shortage at all and mostly because everything's grown right here. So everything's grown actually down by the Piers area and we have control of our inventory because we do it ourselves. But for other states around the country, trees can not only be hard to find, but prices are likely to increase about 5 to 10 percent nationwide. We're dealing with a lot of that too, that they're worried about the price going up and here prices have gone up about five to ten dollars, not out of the ballpark, just kind of trying to keep up with all the other costs. With just a small rise in price and a sufficient supply, there are no worries for those looking to buy a tree in Minnesota. It's a really, you know, fun time of year for us. Um, people are excited about the holidays. They want to buy a tree. It's a tradition. It's a Christmas tradition that will continue to live on. Reporting in Brainerd, Sarah Winkleman, Lakeland News. Large tree exporter states like North Carolina and Oregon are expected to be hit the hardest. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.